so first of all awareness is the primary part the developer should be aware that okay if i am responsible for writing certain piece of code then that code piece of code should be secure now when we do anything we ensure when we talk from security i always give examples of like our home or office we ensure our doors are locked while living to the home if our children are there we ensure everything is locked so the same thing when we are creating any app creating any portal website anything which sh it should be secure nobody should other person who is not intended to use that the data or use that piece of uh, uh, software or that uh, data inside that that should not be allowed so all the authentication mechanism should be correct uh, they should not think that okay uh, if i am writing an api then who they are not bothered if that api is hit 10000 times within a minute because they are not having a proper authentication they are not having a proper mechanism to check that because they are, they don't know even that part. so first they should be known that okay if anything is there it's an possibility that it can be attacked for a brute force to get certain credentials of that and use that data for some other malicious intentions so that has to be secured first if your door is secured and then inside you have a door then you have a vault vault is also locked doesn't mean that door is locked your vault is open and just like that so you have a security everywhere in your house same way in application also you should have a compartmentalization you should have a security and that should come into your architecture once it is there in architecture the developer who is going to develop knows that okay i have to also adhere to certain security protocols certain security constraints or some mitigations that has to be a part of my code and second is you we do the reviews we do the peer reviews code reviews but we don't do the security review of that code yeah. now that security review is must if i am using let's say node js or python it has come up with a lot of pre built packages now those pre built packages may not be the uh, completely secured so again those things also has to be tested there are certain commands uh, like in uh, npm or pip like audit nobody uses audit command everybody lets down get the get install upgrade and that's it nobody even people may not know the audit command also but that audit command will verify the packages whether are marked as a secured or not and even github also has an advanced security tool azure also has the same yes. so a lot of uh, other tools are also there which uh, identify the security part of every component which you are using as a open source open source community has given a lot of things but that does not mean everything is secured and we have to use it as it is